An update now on a neighborhood crime alert at the beach is a local man is being credited with helping contain a serial burglary suspect who crashed in front of his home after a police chase. We told you on Friday that police arrested John Kidrowski after they say he stole about $2,000 worth of merchandise from Julie's Jewelry at Atlantic Boulevard and Girvin Road. He was caught after a high-speed chase. Channel 4's Vic Michalucci spoke with a man who helped police arrest Kidrowski. Vic. Kudrowski is also suspected in potentially dozens of smashing grabs in the beaches area. This is video that we first showed you last week of the robbery at the jewelry store. Now, the man who helped police says it was about 4 in the morning last week. He and his wife ran out to see what was going on. Their power pole, it had been knocked down, and they say it was a dangerous situation, but it did not stop this good Samaritan from helping an officer out. Amen. This is video from right after police arrested John Kudrowski. We come out and stood next to my uh, garage there, and we seen the guy running into the pole repeatedly, backing up and running into it. Tony Self, who lives here, says once the man ran away from his truck, the JSO officer released the canine to stop him. Yes, right Self says he ran out to see what was going on. So he was attacking the dog? He was kicking the dog, yes, sir, in the face, uh, in the ears, in the head. Self says moments later, the officer asked for help, and he helped pin Kudrowski down until backup arrived. That's got to feel good. Yes, sir, I love it. It's the end of what seems to be a pretty wild crime spree. He's only been arrested on the jewelry store heist, but police at the beaches think he could be responsible for dozens more. Right now, Jacksonville Beach police tell me they have not charged Kudrowski with any of the crimes committed here, Remember, there have been 41 business burglaries over the past month, and they believe that he's responsible for several of them, but they say they are waiting to press charges because they want to gather evidence to be able to prove it. You don't expect that to happen. From Jack's Beach to Neptune Beach, we found store after store broken into. Surveillance video we obtained today shows a man resembling Kudrowski breaking into a dry cleaning business on Penman Road. The thief used a brick to smash through the front door, grabbed cash and valuables, and sped off in a pickup. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Very wild. Uh... Tony Self is just grateful he could help and hopes this arrest keeps a dangerous man behind bars for a long time. Yes, sir. I like to do my part. I just got off the phone with the police sergeant. He says Kudrowski is still in the hospital because of those dog bites. After that, he will head straight to the Duval County Jail where he is facing a number of charges like burglary and resisting arrest. Now, as for Tony Self, the Good Samaritan, he says the Jacksonville Sheriff's Office is going to give him an award for helping the officer and canine control the man until police got there.